Thursday thoughts. Um, thinking out loud. So, making that progress, being patient, following the plan, doing everything that you're supposed to be doing, doing things that you should be doing when you're not told to do it. All of those things help push you toward that goal. Um, This morning for my workout, just wasn't feeling it. Um, I don't know, I was just tired. Uh, Plus it was leg day, I hate doing leg day. Um, I pushed through the workout. I didn't do my cardio um, because I, I've been running for a lot of consecutive days, so I do need to give my body a rest on the cardio. Um, but I still made some type of progress because I still got my tail up out of bed and I still went into the gym and I still pushed some weight. Um, now, was it significant progress? No. Uh, is it progress that I'll notice? No. Progress that I'll feel? Potentially. Um, but it's more progress than I would have made if I hadn't done anything. Um, so the patience comes in where I got up and I did something. It was just a little something, but I did something. Um, now I have to be patient to see the results of that little something come to fruition Uh, I can't expect to do that little something and have significant progress immediately following so you know just take it one step at a time Uh, keep making a little bit of progress at a time be patient wait on the goals to, to, to come to fruition um, sometimes it takes a while um, sometimes it takes a lot longer than we want to wait but as long as you don't give up and it's easy to give up especially when you're not getting what you think you deserve putting in all the hard work and you're not seeing the results it's real easy to just say forget it I'm done I've done it all I can't go no more I'm finished with it forget it it's easy to do that it's hard to say what else can I do how else can I get better how else can I make myself better it's harder to go out and put in the effort to make yourself better um So, I say that coming from the respect of here I am at 24 years in the Army, 24 and a half almost years in the Army, and I have recently been selected to attend U.S. Army Sergeant's Majors Academy. Um. For a long time, I thought I deserved to be there long before I hit my 24-year mark. But God had a plan for me. Um, it's the, 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 the feeling that I've had since being notified of this has been pretty overwhelming, um, unexpected. Well, not unexpected as in I didn't expect to be there, but unexpected as in I didn't expect to be uh, ranked as high as I am on this this, this order of merit list. Um, But when I was ready to give up, when I was ready to say, you know what, I've done it all, I'm tired, I'm, I'm, I'm 
I'm not I'm not going through this anymore. When I was ready to, to, to just throw in the towel, the Lord told me, my plans are bigger than your plans. Stick with me. I'll get you there. Not only did he get me here, he got me here with a distinction that very, 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 very few people receive. With a distinction of being considered the best of the best by those who viewed my records. Um, and it's humbling. It's humbling. I feel bad even talking about it because uh, I feel like I'm bragging about it, but that's not the case. I mean, I'm, I'm just, I'm, I'm so humbled by this. And I think, you know, my, my, my advice, my guidance is don't quit. If it's something that you want, don't quit. If you don't want it, move on to something else. It's not for you. But if you want it, keep putting in the work. Keep putting in the effort. Don't give up. Um, be patient and wait on God to deliver what he has promised it comes in his time not in yours y'all have a blessed day make progress not excuses